The rules of the game have changed and the masters have a chance to earn an extra command spell. All they have to do is find Castar and kill him. So as we know, he's a bit of a terrifying rogue agent. He's, he's killing children and uh, he needs to be taken out of the series. Although, like I mentioned last time, I like the character. He's interesting, terrifying, but he makes the show entertaining. So I hope we don't kill him off too soon. I want him to be around for the long haul because he's just this horrible menace. And um, yeah, he's fun, for what of a better word. So without further ado, let's just dive into episode number eight. Hey guys, so check out my Patreon link down below with all my socials. So come say hi, don't forget like and subscribe. Time to Time to leave. So that's Maya. <laughs> Here is for you. Madam. I'm making a concerted effort to remember all the names. There's somebody else here. Who else is here? Madam. やってくるのは琴美ね綺麗。おいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおいおい
ちが切り継ぐから教わったのは車の運転ばかりじゃなあはは、ナイスワンそして、生き抜くこと Holy shit Wow, what the hell? She just made a summon. Wow, that is amazing. It's like thread magic. Holy shit, wow. Get out of this one, sucker. Spoke too soon. He probably will. <laughs> what? What the hell? What the hell? What is he doing? What? He's breaking the tree. Maya, hurry the fuck up. Finish him. Don't just... <laughs> She's just watching. He's got... He's broke the tree. Oh my god. Shit. I should have done that 20 seconds ago. Now you're kicked in the face. Meanwhile... These things keep multiplying when you kill them. So his grimoire is his noble phantasm. Wall of Monsters, formerly children. Can you run on the wind? Run on the wind? He's so awful, this guy. <laughs> oh man, make a twist in pain for me, Gene. What a psycho. Holy dooly. Wow, can you run on air? Wow. I love that they're teaming up. Destroy the book. Stop the men. Yep. Exploding in puddles of blood. <laughs> what? <laughs> this beautiful waterfall of red just behind her. That was a good shot. Prepare to die. Oh. <laughs> Ryuk. From Death Note, man. Same face. He's bleeding a lot. Holy shit, man. He's throwing those insults. Free and easy. Holy shit, man. Torture time. Oh, oh, oh. So this is what he's relying on for him to use his magic. Wow, man, look at that animation. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, it keeps cutting. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, so much blood. What is going on? What? Oh, he got away. が Okay. Disclaimer, I also haven't recorded a reaction to this series for about two to three weeks due to, due to me having um, surgery on my face. So I took some time off from, re from recording. I'm fine, but I did have a hiatus. Just a magic bullet. Your origin will destroy their magic circuits. Magic bullet. Can fuck up a, a mage. And he just shot him. Kana. Just got shot with a magic bullet. It's gonna fuck up his magic circuitry. Which is gonna destroy him as a mage and a human. Whoa, is he dead? I mean, bullets usually kill. Oh, he's just alive and messed up. セイバーのマスターよ。そういうことか。俺のマスターは殺させない。セイバーのマスターも殺さない。俺も彼女もそのような形での決着は望まない。夢忘れるな。今この場で貴様が生きながらえるのは必要の高潔さゆえであったこ
むしろ切り継ぐが本来の所有者であるセイラーがそばにいて能力を供給しない限りタイヤの効力は発揮しない Wait OK 君が持っている方がいい So is is healing her as long as Saber is near her she's gonna heal Wow OK cool Avalon's power. Saber. So Saber's mana feeds Avalon, which in turn heals Iri, and now she can heal Maya. Perfect. So they show me. Kill a unga yoka takirito. So give a donor kawa karana. キリツノを守るのは私だけじゃないそうよね次こそはどこと ?I don't know, キリツグを守り抜こうね。You kick both your asses very easily.The mage slayer.Now's also men.It's a good show, like the plot is. Convoluted only because, like I mentioned before, it's just such a large cast of characters. I'm I'm slowly getting my head around it. It helps with the notes, definitely, but I I, I don't feel like I'm too lost. I mean, when you get a pretty straightforward action episode like this, it's it's quite easy to understand. Great episode, like I said, the animation when it really takes off is incredible. Like the the Silver Sphere, straight out of T2, it looks so good. And the fountain of blood when they're taking on Castor, so that was incredible as well. Like all the monsters just exploding, god damn, it's beautiful. So, Castor got away. Um, I, I was expecting him to. I don't think they're going to take out this character too early on in the series. I mean, he's too good, he's, a, he's an amazing foil as a villain for our heroes. I mean, he's just irredeemable, he's this horrible, monstrous child killer. So He's gonna meet a sticky end, I'm sure, but not yet. I enjoyed the, the fight scene between Kaneth and Kiritsugu. So, Kaneth was the principal that gave Velvet a hard time in episode one at the school, right? He, he's the one that had his book stolen and now he's controlling Lancer. So, it's kind of all falling into place. I'm gonna check my notes regularly and try and keep、uh, abreast of the situation. But, guys, please comment down below. I wanna get your feedback. You've been amazing so far. Just to kind of clarify a few things, point me in the right direction. It's, it's wonderful so far.、Uh, thank you once again. So, moving into the next one, yeah,、um, I'm excited to do it. My recording schedule is pretty much the same as always. Like, for instance, I'm recording Fate Zero, The Owl House, Naruto, Blue Lock, and One Piece today. And tomorrow, I'm doing Kaiji,、um, the final episode of season one of Made in Abyss, which is a two parter, so that's going to take up a, a, an hour or so of my day. And Dora Hey Dora,、um, and then maybe another episode of One Piece or The Adventures, My Adventures with Superman. So, depending on, on how I go with my, my, with my time, I just record for a few hours, like from 9 9 30 11 30 or 12. So, a few hours, a couple hours blocked out in the morning for recording. Then I go about my day, and then from four to five, I'll, I'll edit an episode or two. So, yeah, it's, it's fairly busy. There's a lot going on behind the scenes, and this is like every day. Not recording, I do go to work as well. So, recording is done on my days off. So, when I've got a day off, I'll record, which is usually two days, and then work for the rest. So, I'm, I've got a lot of juggling. I've got a lot of juggling with my editing and my scheduling. But I am thinking of mixing things up with, with YouTube, like I mentioned. I'm, I'm releasing a show every day. I, I got a comment from somebody which just kind of like was like a moment of clarity for, for me. Like, you'd get more views if you released only one or two anime a week. I'm like, you're probably very, very right there. So, I'm going to do a couple episodes of Kaiji and a couple episodes of Hunter x Hunter only on YouTube and just. Build up a back catalog of, of, of a series. So, there, yeah, yeah, I'm keeping you in the know about what I'm doing. So, I'm just <laughs> behind a sneak peek behind the curtain. So, please comment down below. Don't forget, like, and subscribe. Catch you next time. Thanks for watching.